What do you think about having a school named after you? I think it's a great honor. Um, what visions do you have in the future for Foursquare Charter School? Well, I think this school will take and see many, many classes through, and the students will do very, very well. All right, thank you. Thank you, sir. What about 10 years or 20 years from now? What will education look like 10 or 20 years from now? Will this room be full of robots wearing khaki pants and forest bird t-shirts? Without any doubting or quitted, he started to sing as he tackled the thing that couldn't be done and he did it. There are thousands to tell you it couldn't be done. There are thousands to prosperously, to prosperously failure. There are thousands to point out one by one the dangers that wait to assail you. But just buckle right in with a bit of a grin. Just take off your coat and go with it. Just start to sing as you tackle the thing that could not be done and you'll do it. I'd like to thank you on behalf of Forrest Myself, his daughter Kathy. Kathy, where are you? I know you're here. The, the, the grandchildren, Devin and Darren, stepdaughter uh, Rachel, and then Nathan, and, and number one grandbaby Julianne, if you haven't met her. So she goes around, I think, the, the charter school to some of the different meetings and is at the museum a lot. But uh, our family. When Alan had first talked to him, talked to Forrest, about the school being named after him, Forrest thought, no, 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 no. <laughs> when we left, when, when, when the conversation had, had ended, he, and I said, well, Forrest has such an honor. And he said, well, I know it's an honor, but I only know of schools where dead people. <laughs> you have to be dead first, and I'm not ready to die. And you have some big shoes to fill. I've had people ask me for his shoes. <laughs> I'm like, wow, you want those? You have no idea how long he wears those New Balance shoes. So I have sent them out, and I have sprayed them and put baby powder and stuff. But not because he's my husband. I've worked with some of the greatest inventors in the world. But because you have shoes to fill. And those shoes are of honor. They're of pride. They're of education. They're of innovation. They're of the love for our country. And maybe I'm not supposed to say God here, but they're for the love of God. Amen. And invent. It's okay to think outside the box. I probably, in working with inventors, have been more thrown out of more places than many people have gone into, but it doesn't matter in the type of work I do is placing products and technologies. And think of the numbers of times that, that Forrest was told it's not going to work, it's not going to work. But whose life did he save? How many in here, in, how many people in here know of a person who's been, who's, who's used Medivac, as he has pioneered Medivac, who's been on a medical ventilator. Does anybody know? Oh, so you know. You're honored and humbled, and on the other hand, it's giving this school the wings to fly. The wings of innovation, the wings of, of hope, the wings for the future, and we thank you. Force thanks you. And he's so humbled and honored, and we love our community, and we love this school. Thank you. That's about as official as we get right now. That was an official movie cutting. <laughs> Ask it again. What do you think about having a school named after you? I think it's a great honor. Um, what visions do you have in the future for Forest Square Charter School? Well, I think this school will take and see many, many classes through, and the students will do very, very well. All right, thank you. Thank you, sir.
It breaks his heart seeing foreign cars Filled with fuel, it isn't ours And wearing cotton we didn't grow He's got the red, white, blue, blind, high on the farm Semper Fi tattooed on his left arm Spent a little more in the store for a tag In the back it says USA He won't buy nothing that he can't fix With WD-40 and a craftsman wrench He ain't printed dirt Come